music. Let's go. I'm your boy, Ro, OG member of the Orange Bowl Boys, and welcome to the second half action of Miami Hurricanes vs. Ball State, only found on the Orange Bowl Boys channel. Let's go. Now, I'm going to let this play in real time, okay? Doesn't seem like much. They're going to motion Damian Martinez out of the backfield. They're going empty, quick toss. And, yeah, we're going to get a little assist from the South Florida weather. A lot of people slipping and falling. Hey, which, you know, it just goes to show you to all those teams coming in there. If it happens to rain, you might want to go ahead and have your <laughs> other style of cleats because, you know, we're used to this stuff. Obviously, you weren't. But let's go back and watch exactly how this play happens. Okay, first of all, when you see the motion start to go away, there's a two-part process to this play, right? Quarterback's a pre-snap read. He's going to look to see – which is his hot side based on numbers. When the linebacker is going here, it's three first three. Then he looks out here, it's more advantageous, a lot more space. So he's going to take this side. He could have either thrown it out here to Damian Martinez, but in this case, astutely, he goes here. But pay attention to the blocking. It's the blocking, okay? Right guard right here is initially going to move this way. Now, what does it do? Linebacker is literally watching at the guard go the other way, and he's like, what just happened? Because where the guard goes, the play goes. This ball's coming out. This linebacker hasn't even moved. <laughs> Just enough eye candy there. Took a little bit of the flow bait. Now he's lost in the sauce. So now there you go. And now this is how we gain the advantage. One, two, three, four, five. Look at all the blockers now we have here. Good caravan in front, running behind it. Easy pitch and catch. So when you saw that, bang, by the way, when you saw that, you were like, yeah, okay, bro. Nothing overly complicated. But again, using the motion, using the guard to come across, got the linebacker to kind of stick there just a little too long, and Miami came back the other way with the numbers advantage. Good play. Mr. Williams is now into the game. Here we go, University of Miami, second and one, up 38 to nothing, not necessarily taking your foot off the gas. This is straight play action. Notice a little, then you notice a lot. First of all, tight end, this is Cam McCormick, just looking out. Why is he looking this way? Probably because that's his guy in blitz pickup. Now, we learned this last week. We've said this on this channel before. This is how you know if it's the difference between an RPO and a play action. This is play action. Pay attention to the offensive line. They're going to immediately kind of back away from the glass, bump the glass. There it is, bumping the glass. They're not coming through the glass. So this is a straight play action pass, one in which University of Miami are employing, kind of like max protection strategies. But the ball fake, you know, Williams puts the ball down. Look at what it did to the safety, and we'll go ahead and back that up. Got him completely out of phase. Nice pitch and catch. Nice easy. Man, I love this weather because these guys keep slipping. Again, straight play action pass. Really, we're going to only have three in the routes later on. We're going to release some guys, but initially they're here for pass pro. There they are sitting there. Let's block, 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 and then nobody's coming. Then we'll go out. Only three people in routes. Play action pass out into the perimeter. Great rhythm. Great timing. First down. Nothing overly exotic on this third and five. A very accurately thrown football. Tight end here to the bottom of the screen is going to do an out. Wide receiver is going to do a simple slant. Safety is going to get there, but when you have confidence in your accuracy and getting the ball out on time, one step, there's ball out. Way to hold on to the tough contested catch. And we're going to go ahead and mark that as a first down. I do want to back this up, though, because... <laughs> I know we're trying to get a first down on third and five, so I'm not calling this a misread. That's not how it works. You got to get a ball out. You make your pre-read side. Ball was a first down. I'm just saying this. I just want to highlight just this guy trying to cover Xavier Restrepo was like this guy wasn't even there. So pay attention to this top screen. Ready? Just runs right by him. Yeah. You're lucky we were just trying to go for the first down there. A pattern starting to emerge week to week, and that is when you're trying to guard – a University of Miami defensive end. I'm going to call this the Jason Taylor effect because when you're trying to guard this with a tight end, uh, these tight ends are not winning this routinely. Watch how quick this is going to get shed. Yep, nope. That happened against Florida as well. It's a it's a tenacious pass rush, my friends. Uh, we're going to continue to let this play because I like the next view that's coming out. Uh, that's, this is good, exactly. Here comes a tight end one-on-one, -on -one and yeah, yeah. No chance. Let's meet at the QB. Miami continuing its pressure. Tackles for loss. Jason Taylor effect. And this is going to be the Paul Bange blow the roof off clip of the week. First play of the fourth quarter. Hey now. 
So this is going to actually be an RPO. I want to show you the RPO side of it because just pay attention to the way that the offensive line is going to come out and block this. Again, Miami, a very lethal 11 set team, one running back, one tight end, AJ Allen, and this is Elijah Lofton. Now, Pay attention to Elijah Lofton. If he decides to pull that, right, he decides to pull that in the way that they're blocking this out front, you know, that's that's the toss right there. You even saw him figure, like, okay, the toss is there if I want to because I can just kind of pull this, ride this down, and come over here. Uh, and that's not what happens. Now, again, feel atrocious. Let the body hit the floor. It, it's been doing it all night long. But, again, coming across the formation, bringing some of the flow with you, and then, my goodness, the move that's about to happen, right? Oop. There. <laughs> oh, my goodness. The rain got the other guy, but uh, A.J. Allen, well, he got that. Uh, bang! <laughs> Paul Bage Roofing. Hey, I'm Paul. Give me a call. 561-954-305-981-ROOF. Hey, Emory Williams. I see your spidey sense kicking in, and I'm glad it did because it led to the touchdown. The University of Miami, again, an 11-set personnel. They're going to try to have two in-breaking routes, and they're using Elijah Lofton on this exit motion, and he's going to just continue on a wheel route. So let's pay attention to the spidey sense. Here it goes, snap of the ball. He's looking for this first in-breaking route right there, and there was the pump because he noticed that there was a Mike linebacker right in his view at this point. Kind of took some of the safeties with them, and then Emery's just going to see the, the gift and there it is, but I want to go ahead and back this up because <laughs> this is funny. Pay attention to his safety. Has no idea what's going on. Ready? He's off the frame, and now he's going to come back on the frame. Ready? Right here. Look at him. Like, where's the ball? Where's, where, where's the ball? <laughs> oh, it's over there. Bang. Yeah. And this is going to be the last clip of the evening. Second half action is about to close. University of Miami are up 62 to nothing. 314 at this point. But I'm going to end with this. Hey, we saw it earlier. I said, hey, this was an RPO. This is actually the RPO I was talking about. But this time they're going to actually keep it and throw it to the tight end on the other side of the field. There he goes. He just pulls it. There goes right his key. Dumps it off. Okay, cool. That's kind of not why I wanted to use this video because the University of Miami are trying to send a message, okay? Second and 17, there goes the ball. Pay attention right here. Now there was some hand fighting going on, stuff like this, but you want to finish a game and you want to put some things on film? Let's watch this. <laughs> Go until the end of the whistle. <laughs> that a boy. And I just want to back this up again too because uh there you go you just keep driving keep keep driving now i want to focus on this riff hey hey don't you don't you do it don't you don't you do it i'm your boy ro og member of the orange bowl boys stay safe my friends bang